Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Dave from Apple Unlimited. Uh, recently I found a really cool app that I can't keep to myself. I have to share it with you. Uh, it's a free way of uploading all your pictures and videos. Uh, not only is it free, it is unlimited and it's actually very easy to use. So everyone should be doing this. Um, stick around, I'll show you how to do it. Yes, you heard me right. I have a new secret weapon, and the app itself is called Google Photos. Um, I know that when it first came out, it was only available through Google Pixel, which is a Google phone. Uh, now it is available for anybody who has a Gmail account. Uh, so if you have a YouTube page, you have a Gmail account. If you don't have one, it's super easy to sign up for. Uh, it takes about two minutes to sign up for it. Uh, you don't even have to really use it. You just have to sign up for it and you get it. Um, so basically on your phone, let's say we have an iPhone, let's say we have an iPhone, uh, we go to the App Store, do a search for the Google Photos app, it's free, download it, uh, log in, just tell it if it asks for like access to your photos or whatever to say yes, and it will automatically start backing up your photos um, and videos right away. I had over 10,000 so it took a while, <laughs> but it's done now. And they're in the cloud, and it's just a really great peace of mind knowing that all my stuff is backed up. Um, say, you know, you're at work and you're like, oh, I got to back up my phone, I haven't done it in like a year. And you're driving home, and your phone flies out the window and it's gone forever. Like, your photos are just gone. That's it. There's no more of those. Um, but if you back it up, you'll always have it. And what's cool about it is that you can go to your iMac and pull everything up. You can go to your iPad, pull it up there. Uh, so you can access your files from every device you have. So think about that. That's even cool in itself. Um, that's a good enough reason to do it. You don't have to transfer all your photos. You just pull it up and they're right there. And you can download it to your computer if you want or whatever. Um, that's one scenario where it's really great. Another one is if you have an iPhone with a, a low storage, like 16 gigs, 32 gigs, um, you can um, back everything up and erase it off your phone and then open the app and they're still there. Um, this is perfect for my dad. He has a 16 gig phone and he's always like, I want stuff on my phone, but I'll, you know, if I delete it, it'll be gone, you know? Uh, so this is a good solution for that also. I'm gonna definitely recommend that he does that. Um, another, another reason to do it is it's just great to back up stuff. Say you back it up and you forget about it and you find it 10 years later, boom, you get a treasure trove of old photos. That's just really cool. Like I found an SD card today that I forgot about from a long time ago and I found a bunch of really cool photos on it. That's just, that's just a neat little surprise. Um, so not only will it back up your photos and videos, um, it will automatically create little slideshows um, based upon what it thinks you'll like. And it's actually really cool. It'll create GIFs. Um, of, from random videos and those are actually my favorite part. Um, I do have a few I want to show you of course. Uh, there is no music so I'm going to add music to it. Um, well check us out. So getting it for just that alone makes it worth it. I think that's a really cool feature. Um, so all you have to do when you first get the app is just let it back everything up. You can open it up and it'll start automatically. Uh, you can close the app out and let it do it in the background. And as long as you're on Wi-Fi, it'll do it. Um, depending on how many videos and stuff you have, it might take a while. Mine took kind of like a couple days. But I do have videos that are 20 minutes long and stuff like that. I had over 10,000 pictures of videos, so that's kind of why. Um, but once it's done, it'll stay done. And then whatever pictures and videos that you take along the way, it'll just do it in the background as long as it's not closed out. Um, which that is a really cool feature too. It's like an auto backup. 
So the app itself is called Google Photo. I do recommend everybody get it, everybody use it. Um, I get I get nothing out of you using it. I'm just trying to make your life easier. And I think that this will. It'll improve your life a little bit. Uh, so cool. Thanks for watching. This is Dave, and we'll see you soon.